these very disturbing developments have called for the need for security to be tightened around our traditional rulers to ensure that the increasing threat to their safety is averted. I would use this opportunity, Mr. President, to call on the Inspector General of Police to direct the Commissioner of Police in Plateau State to provide security to our traditional rulers in their palaces so that they will be secured and the increasing threats to their safety be averted. Mr. President, it's also unfortunate that just this last week, five of our youths who were arresting and having an evening out were brutally assassinated in Vom, in Kvom of Guam District in just South local government. All of these developments are providing increasing insecurity in my constituency. And I thought it's very necessary, Mr. President, distinguished colleagues, to alert and bring this to the notice of the Senate that Plateau State, and particularly my constituency, that has witnessed the return of peace is suddenly again being visited with these very ugly attacks. And of course, Mr. President, it's common knowledge that the, sus the attackers are suspected to be killer hatsmen. And this is very disturbing in a nation that we need to be our brother's keepers, a nation that we need to build, uh, have a common destiny, but Plateau State needs urgent attention security-wise. Thank you, Mr. President, distinguished colleagues. Thank you very much, uh, for the theory. This is not open to, to debate, but let me, on behalf of all of us, uh, the Senate, uh, send our condolences to the, gov to the governor, government, and people of Plateau State, particularly your senatorial district, where most of these uh, uh, incidents took place and we pray that um, the security agencies, like you suggested, should provide uh, sufficient security around, of course, the traditional rulers, but provide security for everybody. The situation uh, requires that we continue to work together with the executive arm of government until we find uh, enduring solutions to the security challenges that this country faces. Thank you very much. May the soul rest in peace. Yes, Senator uh, Isajibrin. 